From weddings to themed luncheons, people keep coming back time and time again to the Inn at the Villa Bianca. Joining me now is Executive Chef Tony Mavuli and owner. Nice to see you here again. It's always oh, a pleasure. Nice to be back. <laughs> so tell me, you're in the height of wedding season and uh, a lot of amenities for brides at the Inn. We do, we do everything in the villa. We take care of the brides from the, when you start or when you get engaged to the end. Really? We, uh, we use one team, we say, we literally put you to bed, say, kiss you goodnight. Oh, that's so great. And we, we have, a, have uh, you have a new, some new areas at the end. Yes, we have the new gazebo there. We can beautiful sit by nice little running brook there. <laughs> very romantic. We have Ooh. all new stairs, very uh, railings, very ornate, very rich over the bridge with the waterfalls inside and then of course we have the pavilion now we became uh, we redo all with all marble fireplaces everything well, you know i think so, what's nice about the pavilion is you could still have the wedding outside even if it rains even if you're it covered. rains it doesn't matter it just is a pavilion is a place is a room without windows type of thing right. so really you protect either way so we should mention that you can help out with invitations there's a limo service it's one-stop shopping is when it? the bride he book with us, we take care of from A to Z. Like I said before, literally, we put you to buy the kiss you goodnight and the <laughs> wedding is over. From limos to invitation, also we help with the photography and the jail. We have a beautiful repertoire of people, very nice professional, we can recommend. They are Great. top of the line. Well, can you help with grooms too? <laughs> <laughs> what are we making we'll today, try. Tony? <laughs> It's summer, so yes. because of summer, we choose to have a beautiful soft shell crabs. Oh, they're in season now, aren't right, they? Right, right, right. And now, the and point of the soft shell crab, you could eat right through the shell. You can eat everything the shell. through. So you can need okay. a little bit of clean, you get done. And there's beautiful summer dish, uh, easy to make. So I put a little olive oil in the fry pan, we get a little nice and nut. So can you also put these on the, say, the barbecue? Is it better to do them inside, you think? I, I prefer a pan fried. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I prefer a pan fried. And then you can use a sandwich with a little bit, uh, whatever is your flavor. Okay. Dressing type and thing. And I see a nice uh, an orzo salad here. What, what is this? I like to serve with a nice, beautiful, fresh, cold orzo salad mixed with a onion, little tomatoes and mangoes is refreshing. Ooh, the and there's little and grapes in there too. Right. How great this and is. This is a piece of cake too. You just boil the orzos and then just cut it up. Cut it, it doesn't up. have much of a dressing on it, does it? Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. It's dressed with olive oil. Okay. Little vinaigrette. Okay. Now, how do you know when these guys are done? Oh, you can tell. It became a nice golden brown. Okay. Okay, so I think we have enough here. You can see. Oh, they turn brown fairly quickly. Okay. Yes. Now, Tony, well, that's cooking. Tell us about the porchetta dinner. It's the first Thursday of every month? Yes. Every Thursday, the, every first Thursday of the month, we have a nice porchetta dinner. We serve nice antipasto, and pasta fagioli, sometimes tripa also. Ooh. Look. Look at the look at the Those color. Are beautiful. You see what I mean? Very nice. And all so, you do is put a little olive oil in the pan. Always olive oil. Okay. Yeah, it's like to take a little, you know, maybe five, seven minutes. Okay. And uh, it'll be done. Then I already prepared this. It'd be a beautiful combination. Nice. Yeah, very colorful for summertime. Very, for summertime is beautiful dish. Tony, tell, tell me about uh, the new restaurant on the grounds. We broke a ground for the new restaurant. It's called 1757 Tavern. Okay. So it's going to be continental dinner, also mm, chops, steaks, and private room for small little parties, 15, 20. We get a lot of inquiries about that, so we try to a reverse of dinners. I see. So okay, great. It, can, it cannot be better than that after you finish. And reversal, yeah. you, when you get married in the chapel outside, we have a restaurant right two oh, minutes away. for the away. rehearsal dinner, per be, piece It can of be cake. not perfecter than that. All right. Tony, tell me about uh, the red, white, and blue luncheon. 
for the seniors. That sounds like fun. Oh, yes. We try to organize some parties for the senior citizen, all different type of the year from, you know, uh, summer, uh, spring, summer, and fall, all the way to Christmas, and then also Christmas we have a nice uh, That's Christmas great, and that's present. July 13th. Right. Well, these crabs are coming along very nicely. Oh, yeah, very nice. Look. Oh, I love oh, that. Oh, yeah. How... Well, that's terrific. That's going to be great with the orzo salad. You know, in case you didn't catch the recipe, we'll have it all on our website at WTNH.com. And you can check out the Inna Villa Bianca in Seymour. The telephone number is 203-735-4883. And the website is thevillabianca.com. I'm going to grab a fork, Tony. What do you think? Please enjoy. Oh, you it's don't delicious. have to tell me twice. I think I will.